Greetings, my name is Razor Wolf, and let's start up a survival world. I would have done it directly in screen, but I just wanted to show you no bonus chest, no seed, no nothing. I'm literally getting into it. Saved as New World, didn't it? Okay, oh well. Yes, I will have to deal with it. So, ooh, stop volume. Nice. So, as soon as you get into the world, you go up to the nearest tree. This is going to be more or less a tutorial on what to do. And you start punching it. You literally start punching the tree until it gives you the wood. Now, as soon as you get in, you have to immediately start preparing. Music, too loud. There we go. So you try and get as much wood as you can. That's why you should have enough now. Once you do, you exchange some of that wood for planks to make a crafting table. Once in there, make a few sticks, make some tools. We'll start off with a axe because each tool has a specific purpose. Axes are good for getting wood, pickaxes are good for mining, Shovels are good for like dirt and sand. Hmm. Come down, wood. But if you have not noticed, as you use any tool, it will go down over time. Give me my wood. Alright, I think that should be enough for now. So, on your first day, some resources that are good to get are food, wood, and I personally would find a good spot to just kind of hang out for the night. If you see flowers, personally I would get them just be a swamp. That's good. Ooh, with a lot of animals. Better. So you can do this with your bare hands. I'm not. It'll take too long, in my opinion. But. What you want to do is just kind of make a small area where you'll be safe from the mobs that will spawn at night. And as soon as you can, try and upgrade the important tools to stone. Um, 
there's three stab tools for three right no four uh, for each set of tools you have wood stone gold iron and then diamond diamond being the hardest to find but also the best Now, when you first start off, you don't want to try and five ought to be good. Just be like, oh, I need to make this huge, amazing base with everything. If you try that, you're only setting yourself up for failure. Start off small. Don't go with anything elaborate just yet. Just start small. Sheep. Hmm. A cave. Uh, there's a few types of... I'm sorry for those people who already have seen this before. People who may not have seen played Minecraft. is going over it for them. There's a few types of mining. There's the what I call hunter gatherers. Most people call them the cave hunters. And this is typically me. But that's only if they're around me. If they're then the other type is the strip miners. You say, hmm, this looks like a nice place to mine. You start mining. Ch hmm. There's chickens, pigs. Ah, this is gonna be a nice place. Now there is a problem with hidey holes. Eh, that's what FedEx Gaming calls them. I just call them your first area, your first house. Um, typically, they're hard to spot. So, a few things you can do to make it easier to see is torches. Also, before night falls, make sure you light up the interior. You do not want mobs to spawn in your house. See, you have a friendly creeper that says, Come on, I want to give you a hug. And a boom. Creeper hugs are not fun. They're quite explosive. Here we go. So, some foods you can make are what I get, especially in the beginning, are mushroom stews, which are amazing. Apples, if you're lucky enough, that tree gives you one. Food, or not food, apples, carrots, melons, cookies, melons, pumpkin pie, spider, fermented spider eyes, cake, and bread. But that's only if you go out and get the resource that requires it, which I have not. 
all I have are mushrooms too. This is what I do in the beginning to mark where my house is. It's easy to see. That's what you want. Jesus, what's with the hiccups? Also, I went straight into my wood planks. You don't have to say you made a... Wooden pickaxe and then you have a stone pickaxe and you're like, I'm never going to use that. Uh, wooden pickaxe can be used as fuel. Your wood tools can be used as fuel. I already had one of those. I mean, oops. So, these tools also can be used as defenses. Your axe has plus four. Your hoe does pretty much nothing. It's the same as punching them. Your stone pickaxe has three. Your shovel has two. So if you have an axe but not a sword, which I should make one right now, use that. It says plus five damage. Nice. I don't really like how I can't see. So. I'm going to cut this video short. Night has fallen. There's not much more I can do. So, I'm going to pretty much just hang out in this hidey hole until day and go and gather some more resources in the next video. So, if you enjoyed day one of our survival, My dog is probably barking in the background. <laughs> um, hit the like button, comment, letting me know you want more, and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.